and I was coming home. The last thing I remember is I, I just like coughed and then everything went dark. Outflashes five six. Hello. Anybody injured? No. Hey guys, anybody injured over here? Yeah, I think you might have his arm was the driver here. in this car here. Yes, sir? I'm the at fault yeah. driver. Okay. Um, I'm just trying to. Uh, whose phone is this? We do have an ambulance on the way, sir. What's your name? Jacob Candelaria. Jacob, would you like to come just have a seat on the curb sure, for a second, I'll my man? Talk to you, whatever you need. <laughs> everybody else. No one's sure. everybody else yeah. no, it's, it's just him in the car. Okay, let's just have you take a seat on the curb, sir. You're not being detained. You're not in trouble. I just want you to sit down just in case you do have some kind of injury going on. Henry 236 PD, can you add New Mexico 26, Adam King George Charles 36? Yeah. The first thing that occurred to me was to get him out of the, yeah, the vehicle saw. because the vehicle was Henry 236PD, can you also add New Mexico 26898, Paul Boy Sam? That's going to be the one on its roof. Yeah. Did you guys witness the crash? No, we no. came up right after we it happened. We just saw it. Okay, you guys are all okay? Yeah. yeah. Right on. You guys we are just there. Okay. okay, thank you. Have a great you too. Sir? So, um, I was just down at Little Anita's. Okay. And I saw him. Sent to a camera to the assist. The light was red and we could. Henry 236 to Sam 28 minor injuries only. Sorry, I didn't mean to interrupt you. Oh, no, you're good. Uh, yeah, okay. Really nice just like punched it okay. about like a quarter mile before while the light red. Ran in. Did you witness the crash too? Yeah. Okay. I, ran, I ran from, from the intersection over here. Do you mind just hanging out so we can get a witness statement in a second? Yeah. We'll, we'll get there in just yeah, a I second. Called, I called it. Right on. Thank you. Have you guys actually witnessed the collision? or No. Do you know what you do in this car? Yeah, these two right here. Okay. They help me out. Nice man. Right. Thank you. Boy, Charles, here you go. Third and Third and copper. Hey guys, do you own these two cars? Yeah. He hit all three of them. Oh, that car too. Yeah. Okay. You guys own all three. Uh, my my cousin. I'm I'm a neighbor. I just saw this. Okay. Did you witness the crash? No. Okay. I was just like, my windows right there, and I just heard a little... Henry, 236, Pete. I guess I'm actually not going to over. Henry, 236. Got two more New Mexico 26s for you. First one's going to be Baker, George, John, Henry, 72. Let me know when you're clear to copy the second. Go ahead. The second one's going to be New Mexico, Adam, Young, Paul, Adam. 6-2? I, I, my office is just down the road on Slate Avenue, and I was coming home. The last thing I remember is I, I just like coughed, and then everything went dark. I honestly don't know. Do you have any health conditions that you know about? I know that I had seizures when I was a child. Okay. Sometimes I have like a neurologic tick. It's never manifest like this. Uh -huh. um, I honestly, okay. that's the one I remember. Okay. All right. Well, we do have the paramedics on their way. Okay. So. All right. Thank you. you. All right. Did, were you able to crawl out of the vehicle? Do you yes. You um, some very nice gentlemen okay. came. I mean, I remember. So... The next thing I remember is screaming for my husband. Uh -huh. For some reason, I thought I was at home. Okay. So I started screaming for him. And then the next thing I remember, I'm, I'm in some space. I don't realize I'm upside down in that space. Um, and, and, and then they helped me out. These nice men helped me out. And I was able to undo my seatbelt. I was okay. yeah. in a seatbelt, and that's what saved my life. And then God or something saved my life and I didn't hurt anyone. Exactly. Uh, Everyone's okay, you're okay. What's a good phone number for you, Jacob?
want to get transported by them, they, they I don't them think so. I mean, I'll, I'm happy to be checked out. Okay. But I think what I'd like is just for my husband. He's a doctor. Okay. He can come and get me, and if anything needs to happen, he can okay. do that. I'm just so happy. I'm A, alive. I didn't kill anyone. No one's hurt. No one's house got destroyed. Yeah, I'm glad you're okay as well, and everyone else is fine. Main move might be if I might be in the way. Okay, we're all across the street walking. Okay, can you tell me what you witnessed? Uh, we were just coming out of Little Indigo's and then, uh, Marco, sorry. Oh, no um, And then we heard it, like, uh, someone punching it, and we looked, and he was still, like, 300 feet from the light, and it was red, and he was, like, deliberately moved. Okay, and he came this way? And he yeah, came this way. I think he hit the curb right here, and then he hit the curb. We heard acceleration. We heard yeah. acceleration. We looked at it, and then we just saw that he ran a red. So we all said, "Oh man, he ran a red." Any of you guys involved? No. You know, okay, sir. I'm, you know, I'm just, I'm just really thankful. Okay. I'm just really grateful right now that I'm here. That's a hell of a crash. I'm glad you're here too, man. I'm sorry. Don't apologize to me, sir. I'm just, just sorry to all these nice people, whoever's car this is. My God. Yeah, that's I mean, what insurance is for, Luckily, right? we have good insurance. I have good insurance, at least. Was alcohol or drugs a factor today? No, sir. All right. All right. Let me get these paramedics. Is it okay with you if they just check you out? I'd like them to just... I would. That would be fine. Okay, I just want to make sure you're vitally good and all that. That would be fine. All right. Hey man, how you doing? No, actually, just one person, one patient. Uh, the driver of that car slammed into all this. He's uh, this bigger, this bigger gentleman over here. Uh, with the shorts. I assisted the man out of the vehicle. Okay. That's the first one, and then the other gentleman too came to help. Okay. Uh, it took a second for him to respond. Oh, I'm sure. You know, and then I, as I as I, I try, I open the I open the doors, okay. and, and try and try to get him out. Once the other guy came, I mean, he he told me to come out, and he was smoking. The vehicle was already smoking, and you know, so that was that was that was the one thing. And then the other thing was, I mean, like it just, it just happened so quick. It just happened so quick. I don't even know how he ended up like facing know, this way. Yeah. Well, thank you for your for, for sure. your help. So, if you guys need any information or anything, um, I think we're good on the information for now. Cool. But I do appreciate what you did. Right on, right on. Nah, I already checked for anybody else. Okay, cool. Yeah, nobody else is in here that right. I saw. What's up, Hans? Oh, dude. How are you doing? How are you doing? Good, man. You? Yeah. It's amazing that guy has no serious injuries. How, how do you say how it happened? Yeah, look at that car. He smashed the no, freaking cap out of that thing. Did, he um, been oh, yeah. I don't know. <laughs> Doesn't seem like he's drunk, though. Henry 236 PD. Henry 236. For 49, we'll have both east and westbound mountain closed uh, just west of Rio Grande. And if you can start a 46 flatbed for one on its roof. He, has, he was flooring that thing. We come out a little and 146, He ran that red and he was just out to the floor. Crazy. He's very, very lucky. He sure is. I've seen. Less significant crashes cause death. I'm sorry, okay yeah, yeah, absolutely. There's no danger or anything. Thank you for asking. I'm glad that dude's okay, though. Yeah. You said you just popped out a little Anita's and saw them. Well, we walked out. As soon as we walked out, he flew right past us. How fast do you think he was going if he just took a shot in the dark? 
He was cool. And I guess you can hear the engine like pegged out. Like that. I'm guessing like, he was going. He was coming. Okay. Placing this way. This thing left when he hit the truck. Right. Spent this way. Yeah. It was like a pizza top. Wow. Well, thank you. Which engine are you guys? Uh, 17. 17? Do you have any yeah, firearms, yeah. anything like that? In no, the vehicle? sir. No. Okay. Uh, anything of value you need? My cell phone is in there, okay. and uh, my glasses. Other than that, oh, I think my wallet. Um, but those are all things that are replaceable. Sure. But uh, what happened exactly here? I go to uh, and the folks I was working late at my office. Law what do you office. Do? I'm a lawyer. Okay. Right there at five ten. My husband came by, picked up the dog. I was finishing some client work. I came, come down mountain. I got to that light. All I remember was like a cough and my head hurting a little bit. And then I wake up here. And that's the last thing I remember. Do you think you want to go to the hospital just because of the mechanism of what had happened here, man? You know, so my husband is a physician. Okay. So if, if he sees some kind of concerning sign. Is he on his way to come get you? Um, I need to call him. Okay. Um... Let me see if I, I don't want you to crawl back in that car because there's a chance an airbag could still be hot. But uh, where, or what does it look like? It's a black iPhone. It's a larger sized iPhone. Okay. Yeah. Can I ask you just kind of a personal question sure. here? So, I mean, based on the speed and kind of the way this happened, man, are you feeling okay today? Suicidal or anything No, like that? I mean, no. I mean, it wasn't in no way... I mean, I have struggled with depression okay. and anxiety in the past, yeah. but this was in no way... Not related? It wasn't related. I, honest to God, no. I mean, you had to have... I only asked because you had to have some pretty good speed going to achieve what we did here. Um, How fast do you think you were going? Honestly, officer, I don't recall. Okay. I'm not asking because I'm here to give you a ticket. No, I I'm understand. just I... here to make sure you're okay, but... Hey, do you need this? It's sure. On the, it was on the floor. Hey, man, do you think we could maybe work on trying to find this guy's cell phone in the car? Do you guys feel comfortable helping with that? Uh... If not, it's totally cool, but... I don't know. Let me ask my LT, but probably not. Okay. Really. We're going to try, okay? But Thank if, you. if I, not, do you know his number? I'm wor it's the age of everyone's in your contacts. Thank you Someone so much. Call him, okay? We'll wait till okay. it's flipped okay. back over, and okay. then somebody could get in there and right on. if we're not here. Okay. Is that fair? That's more than fair. Okay. It's more than fair. Why don't we give him a call anyway? That okay. way he can start coming. If you want to just hang out here, I'll grab a phone we can use. And what's uh, his name? Corey. Corey? Do you mind if I talk to him? I don't mind at all. And your name, sir? Jacob. Jacob? Okay. Just gonna let him know you're okay. Thank you, sir. 